kept coming. Well, how many do you have left? Uh, I'm out. I'm oh. still not getting a signal. None of my texts are going through. Clear. Never mind that now. I need a towel. Stay with me, okay? Quick, turn him over. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Is Theo going to be okay? I know how to be alone. Please, please, please. <laughs> She fun. Why is the look like that? Honey, please, not now. Aaron! Get your ass over here and help us! I have to take care of Neil, okay? What's gonna happen to Neil if they get in here? I won't let anything happen no, to him. No, no, I'm not leaving. No, no, I'm not leaving. Wait, please. I'm not leaving him. Forget him. We need to barricade the door. <laughs> Neil, go on, baby. Go, 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 go. <laughs> yeah, get over there. <laughs> champagne and stole a limo and drove it into a liquor store. And then we had to go and tell our parents that they had to pay for all the damages while dealing with a hangover at the same time in jail. Come on, that was so much worse than this. My parents did not want me anywhere near you after that. I don't know why, it was all your idea. <laughs> We're gonna make it. Do you think George would let anything happen to you? No. No, and Dean is not gonna let anything happen to me or Haley, so we're all fine. We're not gonna die here. Say it. We're not gonna... Mean it! We're not going to die here. I don't need to knock you out in front of my kid, right? No. Good. Because right now, you might be the only friend I have left. So I need you to be okay. Okay? Is Neil gonna die? Why would you say that? Of course he's gonna be fine. Where's Mikey? Haley, leave Neil and Aaron alone. I wasn't doing anything, just asking about Mikey. Mikey had to stay behind at their house. He was being very bad and he hurt Neil. You don't want him to hurt anyone else. You understand? I guess. George, what do you see? Well, they're chasing someone else now. It's Jeff. We have to help him. What the hell we do? 
We know him! Yeah, we know Mrs. Andrews was chasing him. I'm not letting her in here either. Do I need to remind you you're a guest in my house? Get out of my it's way! Guy, he's right. We can't risk it. We have to think of Haley. Ah! This is crazy. Maybe we try the phones again. We've tried that like three times already. George, please. See? No bars. We must have knocked out the cell towers. Also down. Hey, what the hell happened out there anyway? First you're telling me to get a first aid kit because some kid bit Mikey, then you're screaming at me to board up the windows. I don't know, I mean, it all happened so fast. One minute, we're watching Mikey play baseball, and the next thing we know, the neighbors start attacking us. It all started when that crazy kid bit Mikey. But Neil, he, uh, he saved us. He, he grabbed his hunting rifle and he, uh, he stopped them. But then Mikey, uh, I don't understand. I mean, why would Mikey go after Neil like that? I don't know. But once they got Neil, we lost the house. We barely made it over here. Did you see Mikey's face? The way it changed? All their faces changed. Like they became something else. Something else? Neil's lucky he got away with just a few scratches. We're lucky we got away at all. Well, the cops have to know that something's going on by now, right? I mean, there's got to be something on the news about it. Why is it just repeating? Because there's no one left. This doesn't make any sense. There's gotta be a reason why everyone just changed like that. Maybe it has to do with the leak at the chemical plant last week. George barely made it out alive. Maybe something else got out too. No, I think it has something to do with that dirty bomb. I heard them broadcasting on the radio this morning. Oh, that was in a different state. There could have been more than one. It'd be just like those fucking terrorists to hit us with something biological. Who the hell cares how it happened? We need to figure out what we're gonna do next. Mom, I'm hungry. I guess we better check and see what we have. Is there enough for everyone? Yeah, for now. But if we have to stay here more than a day or two, we're screwed. Does that mean we're gonna have to go back out there? Help should come before then. Enough with the false fucking hope already. We're on our own. George. Language. Honey, I think we have bigger issues than when I say in front of a kid. Like what we're gonna do with him. You said he wasn't bitten. He wasn't, just scratched. Yeah? We don't know how these things turn. For all we know, it could be airborne. If it were airborne, then we're all already exposed. So we might as well stay where he's at. Guys. I'll need to open your eyes. He was obviously infected from his kid. Can we at least tie him up or something? Fine. Sky, Claire, can you find something that'll hold him? He's not infected. It's just until we know more. We gotta finish putting up these boards on the windows. I only got the first floor, and if those things know how to climb- That's why we should be looking for weapons. Please tell me you have a gun in here somewhere. Oh yeah, with an eight-year-old who likes to get into everything? I maybe, don't think so! Maybe there's something in my workshop we can use. Okay, Sky? I'm on it. Haley. Come on, let's put those boards up. Yeah, what if he decides to change while we're up there? How about this? If you hear us screaming, he's trying to eat me! Come running. Sorry. Sorry, but he was being a dick. He just lost his brother in that chemical plant accident last week, and then this, it's a lot to handle. What if he was right, though? I mean, are you sure it was okay to leave Aaron alone with Neil? What if he turns into one of those things? Then you definitely want to be in there. It's the only room with a, a deadbolt. I know, but what if he gets in? And you hit him with this. Haley, why don't you go over there and look for some rope? Okay. You think we're the only ones left? God, I hope not. I can't imagine this is all we have left. With nothing to live for, just waiting for the inevitable. Yeah. 
Let's talk about something else. You started it. Anything else? Bitch. There's nowhere for us to go. Those things have taken over everything. Not everything. We're still here. Dean and I broke up last night. No. That's why he wasn't at the game. He wanted to spend one last day with Haley in case this was really it. What happened? He asked me to marry him, and I just couldn't. Obviously, he didn't take it very well. You know you guys live together, right? Look, I know that it's stupid, but I did the whole marriage thing once already. I'm not ready to do it again. I'm just getting my life back together. We cannot lose this house. We won't. That's why we're boarding up the windows. Yeah, well, we might if Neil turns on us. Oh, come on. No. No, 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 no. You know I'm right. You need to talk to your wife. She's not my wife. He said he can't wait forever. Never trust what a man says. Trust what he does. I saw the way Dean was looking at you. He's not going anywhere. Not now, anyway. But Neil, I am telling you, he is gonna get us all killed. You don't know that. Maybe Skye can- Can do what? She's a first year med student. What the fuck can she possibly do? I don't know. She's all we've got. Yeah? She almost opened that front door. That would've killed us all. Relax. She's not gonna get us all killed. Then why did you stop her? <sighs> I can't believe that's the first thing that came to my mind. My mom and dad are probably dead, and all I can think about is if Dean will take me back. No, Sky. Dean has been your better half for two years. Of course you're thinking about him at a time like this. My brother's supervisor? He tried to save everybody. It's not the same thing. It's exactly the same thing! If that supervisor hadn't have jammed those doors open, my brother would still be alive! But he had to save everybody on block A. And what did he get? He lost the whole damn plant. That's what happens when you try and save everybody. You'll end up killing them all. That's why we need to learn when to cut our losses. So what do you want to do? Kill Neil? Can you do it? In front of Aaron? I thought I was supposed to be comforting you. We'll take turns. Found it. <laughs> that looks like it's about to crumple in our hands. It'll have to do. Okay then, let it go. Here you go, Mom. You think you got enough weapons for everyone? Not really. Sky, come quick. Oh my God, I think his fever broke. You're right. Does that mean he's gonna be okay? Yes, I think so. Good thing we didn't do anything stupid. Don't you ever, ever scare me like that again, okay? I don't know what I'd do if I lost you. Why am I tied up? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Uh, can we get him out of the ropes, please? Not like the ropes are strong enough to hold him anyway. Sure.
Mikey? Haley, can we get Neil some water, please? He needs to get his strength back up. Yeah, I'll go find him something from the fridge. Thank you. Sorry I snapped at you earlier. Upstairs and, and get her cleaned up. Yeah, come on, baby. Everything is gonna be okay. You're right. You were bit. We all know what happens. And hey, we don't know anything yet. We know exactly what happens. You have two choices. One, kill yourself now. Or two, take your chances outside. Fuck you! You take your chances out there. Hey, no one is killing anybody, and we're sure as hell not sending anyone outside. What is going on down here? We can hear you all the way upstairs. She's infected, she needs to go. We already discussed that. I'm not going anywhere. Who says you get a choice? You told me it was going to be fine. You were wrong and now you're just like him. So what? You wanna put me down? Don't I get a chance that I don't show a sign of fucking sickness first? What happened to Neil was not her fault. If she wasn't so busy. Playing doctor. Oh, fuck you! At least I was trying! Oh god, it doesn't matter! We had to leave Mikey behind because he's infected! I mean, why did she need special treatment? I'd... Because I haven't turned into one of them! <sighs> Not yet. But you will, you, you monster! Oh, god. I understand you're upset, but if you come near her, I'm gonna have to hurt you. When I think of Haley, do you really want her to see you turn into one of those things? You don't know that I'll turn. If this is viral, it could be like the chicken pox. You break out once and it goes away. There is a vaccine for the chicken pox, Sky. We don't even know what this is. That's my point. We don't know what this is. Maybe it's only temporary. Or maybe the virus is already inside all of us and only some of us get it full blown. And the rest of us live with it being dormant inside of us for the rest of our lives, like the shingles are... We're supposed to be friends. The least you could do is give me a couple hours and see what happens. Sorry. We can't do that. We have to do what we have to do to survive. You know what? This is my house. You can all get the fuck out right now! You're sweating. My friends are trying to kill me. You'd be sweating bullets too right about now. I just want to fill your head. You're supposed to be on my side. I am on your side. Well, it seems like you're on their side. You just have to be sure. And then what? You give me my two options? Of course not. I know how to get her to leave. No! Let's go! Come on! Let's get Come on! Get out no. of here! Let's go! You want her? Come and get her. <gasps>
Yes. I don't know. Why do you want us to leave? I don't know. Seen dead. Haley, just stop and let me think, okay? Come on, George. Enough. It's deadbolted. Who deadbolts their fucking garage from the inside? It's where Dean keeps his tools. They're trying to keep it away from Haley. I'm sorry. It's not you. It just. They said you're infected. I know. I heard them say that too. It's because Neil bit you? Are you gonna be like him now? Are you gonna die? I'm not going anywhere. But you're sweating like he was. That's a good thing. A fever means the body's fighting back. Neil fought back. He lost. I'm not Neil, okay? So stop worrying. But- No buts. I'm fine, all right? I'm fine. Here. What are you doing? We're not killing her. You just said she's down there with weapons, and in case you forgot, we just killed her man. So we kill her too. Now is that who we are? Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, there's gotta be a spare key around here somewhere. Claire? Where's the keys? I'm not talking about this right now. Claire! 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 You can't kill her. Throw her out fine, but please don't kill her. You keep acting like she's gonna give us a choice. Look, his son was bit and turned within a couple hours. His boyfriend- a Husband. His husband was scratched and turned within two hours. Do you really wanna wait around and see what she does? Does it hurt? Not really. Just stings a little. Look, I get it. She's your friend. But she's already dead. We are not. That little girl is not. But the longer we wait around, the greater chance that little girl has of becoming infected. And then you know what we have to do. Is that what you want? Are they zombies? No, they're not zombies. We don't know what they are. How do you know they're not zombies? Because in order to be a zombie, you have to die first. And they didn't die, they just changed. Besides, zombies don't exist. One of these. Do you think they remember who they were? I don't know. Do you think you will? What? Stay here. See what's blocking the door? Ah, uh, some kind of cable or cord or something. Hey, honey, you didn't happen to grab any bolt cutters while you're down there, did you? Like I was supposed to know this was gonna happen. Are we safe now? Everything's gonna be okay. Mom! Stay back! Come on! She's getting worse. No shit, really? Hey, maybe you can go upstairs and uh, see if you can get something that can help us with this shit. Yeah. Look, just let me try talking to her. You have something better?
much. Yeah, I'm sorry. Sky. Sky, can you hear me? Are you okay? Haley, are you okay? Yes. Good. Can you tell me if your mom is fine? Yeah. Like you care. I do care. Is that why you're trying to kill me? We don't want to kill you. You just can't stay here. Bullshit. You killed Dean. That was an accident. Yeah. Right. How about trying to throw my daughter out of the house? That an accident too? You wouldn't have done it. You keep telling yourself that. Sky. I know you're scared. You're sick. You're getting worse. You don't have much time left, but you have a daughter you need to think about. You're going to turn. Do you really want Haley in there with you when you do? I'm supposed to trust her with you? After what you all did? You don't have a choice, Sky. Not if you want her to live. I can still fight this. No. No, two hours, Sky. It's all you have at most. Then I shouldn't waste any of it with you! Sky, wait! Sky! I'm guessing that didn't work. Nothing. There's nothing. We gotta figure out some way to get her out of there. Maybe um, maybe we can smoke her out. I'm sure something underneath this thing's flammable. And risk burning the whole house down? It's better than waiting for her to come up here and eat us. Just give her some time. She'll come around. All right. I've got an idea. You want to throw the ball around? Not really. Come on. Come here. It'll be fun. Come on. Mom, I said you don't want to play. Come on. Just for a little bit. Remember we used to play Foursquare all the time? We need four people, Mom. Oh, I completely forgot I stuck them in here. What? Your birthday presents. I know it's not until next month, but do you want to open them now? Sure. What are you doing? I'm gonna smoke them out. All I have to do is mix this ammonia with the bleach and the air will become so toxic in there they'll be begging us to come out. And what if they don't? Either way, it'll be over. Well, You look so pretty. You're gonna be a beautiful woman one day. This one's from me. You know, your mom used to be cheer captain in high school. I thought maybe one day you'd like to give it a try. You want me to show you how it's done? Yeah. <laughs> Go to bed anyway, it's past your bedtime. You want to keep it on? It can be your slumber party outfit. Thanks.
This is mine. No matter what, you don't drink from it. Got it? Is that true? What Claire said? Do you only have two hours? You don't need to worry about that, okay? Help is coming. You have to believe that. We're gonna be okay. But what if help doesn't come? Lord, keep us safe every day in every way. Amen. Mom, when we die, we go to heaven, right? Yes. What about them? They go to heaven. I'd like to think so. What if they never die? How will they get to heaven? Honey, they're not zombies. Wanna know how I know? How? Because I've been studying medicine for over a year. Do you know anything about viral infections? Well, a viral infection is like the cold or a flu. And if a viral infection is left untreated, it will either kill you or it will go away over time. And that's what this is, I'm sure of it. So it's gonna kill you? When you see someone with a cold or a flu, they look pretty sick, don't they? And how many people have you seen die from that? None. Okay then. But I read they used to die from it. The human immune system is much more resilient than you might think. So you're saying everything might be fine in the morning? Something like that, yeah. But what if it isn't? I don't know, honey. But I assume that God will find a way to make it right. You just have to believe. Now go to sleep. So? What do you think? I think she'll love it. What's wrong? Nothing, I just... She's growing up so fast. Before I know it, she'll be 18 and off to college. <laughs> think you have a few more years before you have to worry about that. You say that now, but it goes by faster than you think. Just yesterday, I was cradling her in my arms and rocking her to sleep. I thought yesterday 
I had you in my arms, rocking you to sleep as I nibbled on your neck. Oh, you're bad. We should get back inside before Haley wonders what's taking so long. Wait. There's still one more present you haven't seen yet. You're right. Life is short. I've already wasted enough of my time without you in it. I want to spend the rest of my life with you, Sky. I want to scroll together. I want to see Haley grow up. I don't want to miss a second of it because once it's over, it's over. And it would just kill me if I missed out on everything that's to come. So what do you say? You take that chance with me. Mom, are you scared? Yes. Deserve this. There's still so much more I have to do. I should have spent more time with you. I should have said yes to Dean. I should have done so many things differently. Said yes to Dean about what? It doesn't matter now. Go back to sleep. Are you still there? Yes. Promise me you'll take care of my daughter like she was your own. I need you to promise me. Yes, of course. Okay. I'll leave the house. Please, George! I'm just making sure she doesn't try anything funny. Erin. Go get the girl. No! Let her sleep! She doesn't need to see this. When she wakes up, just tell her I love her. Hey, you're not calling the shots anymore. in there too long. No, she's not infected. You had her in there for over an hour, throwing up all around her, hugging her. I was careful. You have to believe me. I didn't touch her. I George, swear. she's just a kid. Oh, so was Mikey. Please don't do this. She's not infected, I swear. We can't take that shit. You told me you would take care of her. You promised me. I can't. I'm so sorry, Sky. I'm so sorry. Stay with me. Haley, look at me. I can't 
do this on my own. We need to get up now. Don't look at them. Keep your eyes on me. Now, we go around them. No. Don't worry, I'll be fine. Stop lying! You're not gonna be fine. You're gonna be like them. Now is not the time. You're gonna be like them. You're gonna leave me, but you keep lying. You think I'm stupid. I, I didn't say that. Then stop lying. You're right. It's not fair to keep lying to you. There's a good chance that I won't make it. It sucks. It's stupid, but it's the cards that we've been dealt. It doesn't mean that I stop fighting. I'm still praying for that miracle, but in case it doesn't happen, I need to make sure you're safe. So I'm gonna run out there right now and draw them away from you. Yes. Take this. Use it if you need to get inside. I'll be right behind you. Promise. making you a bed upstairs. Look, it had to be done. You understand that, right? She was just a kid. Who's most likely infected? Look, after you get some rest, you'll see that. What if it had been me? Would you have thrown me out like that? I did what I did. that it could never be you. What was that? Stay here. Aaron! What's up, is everything okay? We got company. Fucking zombie wannabes. Aaron. We should uh, grab all these tools and take them in the house. But that's a few trips. Yeah, but where would you rather have all the weapons? In here? 
or next to your bed. Stay here. Mom! It's okay. I just got a little lightheaded there for a second. I guess adrenaline can only get you so far. I might just, um, I need a little help. Until it passes. No one can get in here. Well, if your stairs about fortified, then we need to sit trapped by the doors and the windows. Do you know how to do that? Yeah. Neil, yeah. Uh, he taught me. He always liked to go hunting. to him. I, she, she should have got it. I mean, the moment that Mike came in. Oh my God. Oh no. I, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. They're dead. Fucking dead. Why you came down with this fever? I mean, this guy should have known it wasn't natural. She's she, 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 a doctor. I mean, she, 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 she should know this stuff. And that's why she got what she got. Right? That's why she got what she got. We need to make sure that this doesn't happen to any of us, okay? Pull it together! Let's make sure that doesn't happen to us. Okay? <laughs> It can't happen to us. I can't do this without you. Understand? We have work to do. Come on, let's get up. People need someone to blame. Let's go. Okay, you stay here under the bed and don't come out until I get you. What about you? I need to get our house back. Mom, you can barely stand. I feel better now. Mom. It comes and goes. What if it comes again? I'm not gonna lie to you. I can't give up. I need to keep fighting for you. Yes, Haley. Make sure you come back. No matter what, I'm gonna make sure you're all right. What if somebody comes while you're gone? I don't think anyone is gonna come. And Claire and George have my room and Aaron will probably take the guest room. You should be fine in here. And if anyone does come, they're not gonna find you. You wanna know why? 
because you'll be under the bed. And if anyone does come after you, you're gonna stick them with this. Preferably in the neck, but anywhere works, okay? Sky, where's Haley? You left her for dead, remember? I am Haley, baby, I'm so sorry. Stop. You don't have that right anymore. You know I never believed in God or anything, Sky. I always let that be your thing. But tonight I found myself just praying that you were still alive. And look, here you are. Here I am. What are you doing here? I came to get something to remember her by. You guys weren't exactly quiet. Are you gonna tell? Look, I am so happy to see that you guys are alive. I am, but you can't stay here. I can get you some food, some knives. Don't. What, are you gonna kill me? I came here to get my house back. How I get it is up to you. I see. What if I say you can't have your house back? You already threw my daughter out once. Do you really think I'm gonna allow you to do it again? I didn't want to throw her out. You didn't stop him either. No, because he's right. Skye, as much as I don't want to admit it, George was right. You kept her in there too long. She's most likely infected. She's not infected. How can you say that? Look at yourself. You're bleeding, you're dripping sweat. You've been throwing up all over the place. How could you say she's not infected? None of it ever got inside of her. We can't take that chance. Don't. I am so sorry. Don't! George! 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 I'm sorry. Mom, is she? Yeah. Claire! Shit! Let you say something! Claire, you in there? She's fine! If you want her to stay that way, you need to back off now! Not happening! I will kill her! Try me! If you kill her, I swear to God! What? You try to kill me again? I just want to get out of here! Uh, I want to hear from her. If she's okay, Claire, baby, say something! God, she's not answering. Oh, God. No, 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 no. She's back. They didn't jump. No, those things down there. But don't worry. They can't hide forever. <clears throat> They must have gone to the roof. Double back. For a stash. Time to build one trap, but this one trap's good enough, huh? You're not 
not going anywhere. Wait! Don't kill her! Not yet. Up until we get our little brat, I'm gonna enjoy slitting your dog's throat in front of you. you to suffer watching your daughter die. I just need you to die. Go ahead. Do it. What are you waiting for? You better make sure you get me in the head this time. Because we're friends, I'll make it quick. <laughs> we weren't that good of friends anyway. I didn't mean to, it just happened. <laughs> it just happened? <laughs> you don't want to do this. I'm right here, take me. It's funny. It's funny how it's gonna happen right here. This is where your daughter died. This is where you infected her. Please don't! If you would have just left her inside with us, she would still be alive. But you had to bring her in here and then fact her. You killed her. No. Look her in the eyes and tell her that you killed her. Tell her how you wish you could have saved her. Please. Tell her. Okay, okay, just tell. Haley. I love you. All I wanted was the best for you. I wanted to keep you safe. If I could, I would trade places with you. But sometimes we have to play the cards we're dealt, which is why I tried to give you all the tools you need to survive. Remember? Like I told you upstairs. Ah! Oh, you threatened my daughter, and I'll kill you, you son of a bitch! I didn't forget about you, you little brat. Hell, get in the house now! Let's see how you like being infected. You won't infect me, you little bitch! Oh no! You're not getting off that easy. Hey, you're not getting off that easy. Okay? You wanna act like one of them? You're gonna join them. None of that now. You need to save your strength for those things outside. After I watch them rip you apart. <laughs> I'm gonna find your daughter. And I'm gonna throw her outside too. It's 
okay. Oh, it's over. Everything's gonna be fine now. Mom, you're not hot anymore, your fever broke. We need to tie me up. Right now. I don't get it, why do we- Neil's fever broke too. Right before he turned. Come on, we don't have much time. Make sure it's tight. I can't break free. It's tight. Does it hurt? No. My mouth feels a little bit dry, but that's about it. Maybe you won't change. Maybe. But we're not taking any chances. At least not for the next 12 hours. There should be enough food to last you a week if you're careful. There's only enough food for a couple of days. Mom, I'm not leaving you. That was when there were seven people. But now... It's just me. I'm still here. Stop. I'm not giving up. If I start changing, you need to promise me you'll lock me inside here and don't ever come back. I'm serious, Haley. Don't come back. Okay, I promise. Okay. I guess all that's left is to wait and see what happens. Is anybody alive in there? Yes! Yes, we're in here! No. No! No! No!